So I Hi, have children. divided this lesson Welcome into several parts. Hub. The first two Part days we are with a new video and from Grade Seven Smart. Science. Now imagine that you have a chance to go in a trip during your school vacation. Can you suggest a method to find the distance to the places that you accept to visit during the trip? Here you have activity to find out the distance of those places. First of all, find a road map of Sri Lanka. Draw the scale and identify the scale. Place the within thread along the main road and measure the length between two cities. Calculate the distance to travel from Colombo to Kandy, Gol, Mathara, Kurunagala, Puttalam, Trincomalee and Jaffna. Measure the straight length of Colombo to each city mentioned and calculate the straight distance. After that, tabulate your findings. Here this is the table which you have to tabulate your findings. With two cities, distance travel between two cities and straight distance between two cities. By completing this table, you will understand that straight distance between two cities is always less than the distance to travel between them. Now recall an instance where there is a staircase and escalator to go to the top floor of multi-stored building. It may be clear to you that the path of the escalator is linear and it's shorter than the path of the staircase. You may travel from one place to another when you go on a trip. A person may go on one floor to another in a multi-stored building and is escalator goes up and down in straight path. The change of position with time of living or non-living objects is known as motion. The change of position with time of living or non-living objects is known as motion. Distance is the total length of the path of a motion. The direction of motion may or may not change from time to time. Therefore, distance has not definite direction. Displacement is linear length between the starting and ending positions of a motion. When I mentioning displacement, the direction of motion should always be indicated. The length of the road between two cities is known as the distance and the straight distance is known as the displacement. The geographical directions or directions from one city towards another can be used to mention the direction between two cities. The same way, motion along a staircase is a distance and the motion of an escalator is a displacement. The direction of displacement is the direction of motion of the lift. Let's find more about the distance and displacement. Now consider 100 meter and 400 meter running events of a sport meet. Here you can see 100 meter track and 400 meter track. In this track you can see in below straight lines are there. We call that 100 meter track. The round one is 400 meter track. Both events are short distance races. But there are some clear differences between them. Let's see what are those differences are. Here, differences 100 meters and 400 meters. Direction of motion, its direction does not change. In 400 meters, direction changes from time to time. Total length of the path in 100 meters, 100, 400 meters in 400 track. Third one, linear length between the points of start and end. 100 meters in 100 meter track and 0 meters in 400 meter track. The distance of the runner in 100 meter event is 100 meters. 
and the distance of the runner in 400 meter event is 400 meters. The distance between start and end points of 100 meter runner is 100 meters. Therefore, his displacement is 100 meters. The 400 meters runner end his event at the same point where he is started. So, his displacement is zero. As the both distance and displacement are length. The unit of measuring distance and displacement are units of measuring length. Both the distance and displacement are length. The unit of measuring distance and displacement are the units of measuring length. Millimeter, centimeter, meter and kilometer are used to measure length. The international unit of measuring length is meter. The international unit of measuring both distance and displacement is meter. We consider meter by using simple m. This is the symbol. Distance is a quality with the magnitude and displacement is the quality with both magnitude and definite direction. Thank you. Let's meet with the second part.